Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm Rufi Tutorials Guy here, and today I'm going to be um, doing my first Final Cut Pro 10 tutorial. Which um, Final Cut Pro 10 is a great program to have if you're making the transition from iMovie to a new program. Um, and it only it costs only costs three hundred dollars compared to the other one thousand dollar Final Cut Pro 7. So. Um, if you are looking for a slightly more advanced editing program, I go for Final Cut Pro 10. Um, so today's thing is going to be on cloning. Um, you have to be making sure you have to make sure that your camera was filmed from the webcam as I did, or if it, or on a still camera, and that you were in a place where the lighting won't change. So I outside won't work that well. So I see there's my brother on the couch, and then him coming out of the other side of the room waving to his clone. So, um, I'm going to create a new project for this. Clones. And now, gets. A brother. And drag him down. Okay. And so now we have this. Um, what we're going to do now is get the clip of my brother coming out of the other part we want to get right when he starts walking out or before it doesn't really matter okay so now I have that and I'm going to drag that on top of the first clip but for now it's just that all we're going to do is click on the top clip bring up the inspector um, set the opacity down so you can see both people. And now what you're going to do is, is line it up so that find right when he's just about to say, he's going like, oh hey man. Okay, so now I think we have it lined up. And that looks just like that, but which... I guess you could see a possible thing for a ghost effect, but, um, so let's set the opacity back up, and now we're going to click the crop button, which is that, no, the crop button, which is this, and then you can just drag this point, and as you see, as I do it, my brother will appear. And try to put it, put it on a line, like this door. If it's on a line, they won't notice as much the lighting change. Let's so click done. And as you see, this wasn't the best place to do it. The lighting changed in the floor right there, but. So, yeah, and um, you could also just expand this so that the lighting never. Okay, so that was kind of bad. You have to make sure that your actor also never crosses uh, an invisible line in the middle. Because then this, then that will happen. Okay. Um, so thanks for watching this tutorial, guys. If you created this, the cloning effect in Final Cut Pro 10, leave it as a video response below. Um, I'll try to look at it and comment. Please like or favorite or comment below and tell me what you think. Um, and most of all, please subscribe. Subscribe to me, it would really help me out if you want future Final Cut Pro 10 and iMovie tutorials. I'll be doing both of those. So, um, again, bye guys. Thanks for watching this tutorial. See you later.